He's a half-bitten cop looking for a new partner. She's a menopausal lady with a huge collection of Tupperware. Together they are good cop, Indian mum cop. Now, come on. You're on the bank CCTV. We find 400 grand in your flat. You banged to rights. Why don't you just confess? Don't know what you're talking about, mate. Oh, come on, Razor. I'm trying to make it easy for you. So, you've tried the good cop act. What are you going to do? Try and get me to squeal with a bad cop? You'll see. Come in. It's all yours. <laughs> Hello, darling. To do that. I can do what the bloody hell I like. <laughs> I've seen your file. I've talked to your aunt. Oh, yes, me and your auntie Pat have had a nice long chat. You spoke to Auntie Pat. Do you want to kill your auntie with shame? Auntie Pat don't need to know about this. Too late, Sonny the Jim. <laughs> and if she doesn't put you over her knee, I will. Duffin! Ah! Dance! Ah! No bollocks, Nancy! Ah! So, you ready to confess? Confess to what? Confess to being a disappointment. <laughs> I'm not a disappointment. Oh, really? Do you have a girlfriend? No. Aha! My sister-in-law's cousin's daughter has been single forever. Do you like very big girls with monobrows? <laughs> Can we just get back to talking about the robbery? <sighs> this is a photograph of your bedroom, where we found the 400 grand. <gasps> Look at the state of your room. Do you want to catch diseases? When are you going to give your mother some grandchildren? What's that got to do with anything? It's got everything to do with everything, your poor mother. Don't be so selfish. She's the real victim here. Well, I think the real victim is the bank. Ow! <laughs> Tell me, Razor, are you eating properly? What? Oh, look at you. You're so thin. You're wasting <laughs> Let me give you something. We can't expect you to talk when you're hungry. No, I'm, I'm fine. Samosa? No, no. Pagoda? Uh, no, I don't want nothing. Alutiki? Right. No. Biryani? No. Chapati? No. Faluda? No. Dosa? No. Egg curry? Hindi? No. Twigs? No. I'll have the twigs. Hey, look here. <laughs> Leave it alone. You're too fat already. You are a bit lumpy. Ah. <laughs> look at him. Wibble, wobble, wibble, wobble. <laughs> No wonder Priya didn't want to go out with him. <laughs> Razor, tell me, what are you planning to do with the money? What money? The money you stole. You can't leave it lying around. You really should put it into property. <laughs> My friend Sushma, she's selling her place. You know Sushma? No. Everybody knows Sushma. Mercedes. One very big ear, one very small ear. I haven't got any money. I can get you a very good deal. Three bedrooms, double garage, gas barbecue. I'm skinned. A hot tub in the garden for your hot date with Priya. No, I haven't got a penny. It's only 400,000. If you take cash. Got ya. Eating my food, and this is for having filthy thoughts about Priya. He's not worth it. You're two weeks from retirement. I'm all right. I'm all right. We've got what we need now. Take him away. Okay. Come on, darling. Where are you taking me to the cells? No, to the bank to apologize. Move away from the twigs. Oh, <laughs> no.